Yeah. Well, as I talk about this, you can come back to me. But, I mean, I don't think there's any particular virtue about changing your mind. I don't think there, there's anything inherently good about that. If you, if, I mean, the ideal is to get it all right from the beginning, right? If we, uh, so, but we're all, we're all human. We're all growing. We're all learning. One of the things that I said to myself when I was young, because I started writing when I was young, is I, do, I don't want to fall into the air, the pride of saying, okay, I've written and I'm never going to change my mind. Because I wanted to say, I'm doing the best I can to understand these texts, but I want not my own ideas finally to be the authority, but God's word. And I realize, you know, on, on the central issues, the main issues, the text is, is clear, right? But there are some secondary issues. They're important, but they're not as important that, you know, evangelicals disagree on. And there, there we want to, I wanted to keep listening to the text. And I want to listen well uh, to, to other people. So one of the things you do as a scholar, right, you read people who disagree with you. And my goal, what I was taught, is listen to other people with charity. Listen, l really listen to another, what another person is saying and, and be willing to learn from them and even change your mind if you, if you think they're right at the end of the day. I'm, I haven't done that perfectly, I know, but I, but I want to listen to the text. But often God uses other people, right, and their arguments, their reading of the text to challenge me and say, okay, if I read that text correctly, and I, at the end of the day, I want to believe, I want to believe everything God's Word says. That's what I want to teach. That's what I want to believe. I want to hear it. I want to, I want to be open to changing my mind on that. And I think, uh, yeah, I think that's been good. I have friends who haven't changed their mind on anything, and I, I don't think they're not humble. They're, they're more, uh, I, I trust that they have good reasons for what they've believed over the years.